Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today they release new Football Outsider cards as well as a all-new primetime card in Devin Hester for breaking the NFL return touchdown record with his 20th last night against the Bucks in that blowout. 56 nothing in the third quarter and then 56-14 at the end of the game. Uh... Yeah, that was released. If you're wondering where my coins are, I've been doing these style solos. I had to buy a Warren Moon and a uh, John Coon, which I can resell. I did three of the Le'Veon Bell collections as well as one Mike Evans, so that hurt my coins a little bit. I'd be well over two mil if I didn't have to, but short pass is done. Started long pass. Hopefully we'll finish that tonight once I get back from dinner. Uh, ground and pound done. Speed run done. Zone defense done. Uh, we'll get man pass rush and run stuff probably done tomorrow while i watch football and maybe do a little homework but uh yeah we'll be able to finish those up here tomorrow so let's hop in and take a quick peek at all these cards you can look at them a little bit more in depth on your own uh because uh i don't think a lot of these cards aren't going to be highly sought after especially the first one i'm going to go over which is a punter for the patriots ryan allen uh, if the servers would work here. Uh, this is my third time doing this video. I screwed it up twice already. Uh, one, uh, I had the voice volume all the way down so you couldn't hear me. And then the other time, I didn't have a mic selected. So that was fun. Uh, but Ryan Allen is 9,000 coins currently. 97 kick power and 94 kick accuracy. Uh, as well as 70 speed, not a bad speed. And then 76 awareness. Uh, those are the stats of note with him. Uh, take him as you leave it, but he, he is a decent punter. I'll probably pick him up just because he's a Patriot, but other than that, don't suggest picking him up. Next is uh, Sean Trell Henderson, a 84 uh, lineman right tackle for only 4K. So uh, if you're in need of a lineman, this is definitely your guy right here. This is a couple solos away from joining your team. If you need a nice pass blocker and a decent run blocker right here. Uh, he allowed zero sacks and zero pressures by Cameron Wake and 60 snaps. So uh, pick up this card if you need a lineman. He's cheap, and uh, he's pretty good. Uh, let's hop into the next card, though, which is... Who is it? Oh, it's Quentin Copel. Sorry, my brain froze. Uh, Quentin Copel, who is 5K. The stats of note on the back of his card are 90 tackle and 88 acceleration, along with 85 speed, 85 strength, and 85 block shed. A poor 69 zone coverage, so don't expect major things out of him. He also has an 88 hit power, uh, because we know we all love our hit power. Uh, but let's hop into the next card, which is going to be DeMarco Murray. I'm going to have to switch this up to Elite. And DeMarco Murray is currently 94K. There was one up for 88 just like two seconds ago before I did this. The last video, there was one up for 88. Uh, but he's got 94 in speed, carrying, and trucking, along with a 92 acceleration, a nice 96 ball carry vision, and I believe he has some pretty good moves. He's got, uh, let's see here. He Oh, he's got a 68 pass block, so that's of little note, but 68 pass block, so he can protect your quarterback. He's got 94 jumping, uh, 96 ball carrier vision, uh, 90 stiff arm, 78 spin, and 90 and 82 juke. Uh, for catching stats of note, uh, spec catch is 78, catching traffic is 75, and route running is 79. So time to get into the limited edition, which is Calais Campbell. Uh, he's currently 69,000 coins. I will probably end up picking him up, maybe, but uh, we'll have to see. Uh, stats of note are 94 finesse move, uh, 80 power move, so he can do a little power, but he's more finesse, uh, 85 block shed, 81 play rack, 76 speed, and uh, 90 tackling. We can go a little bit in-depth here. Uh, you can look through them. I'll tell you his hit power uh, real quick. Uh, it's down here. 92 pursuit, so that's nice. Uh, 94 stamina. 80 hit power, not terrible, but not the greatest. And then finally... The biggest card out of them all, my personal card uh, that I would suggest uh, taking a serious look at, just because it's a badass looking card, is Mr. Devin Hester, Mr. Return Specialist, the GOAT of returning, 220k currently. Um, it's just a sick looking card, but let's get into the stats here. 
96 agility, 97 in speed and acceleration, 87 awareness, 90 catching, uh, 75 carrying, so you won't have to worry too much about fumbles on returns, 92 jumping, 99 kick return, obviously, uh, 97 elusiveness, 98 ball carry vision, a poor 62 spin, or a stiff arm, but 97 spin and 98 juke make up for that. Uh, he's got 97 injury and 95 stamina, 86 back catch, 90 catch in traffic, 82 route running, and a 78 release. Uh, designed to be your kick and punt returner, but at 90 overall wide receiver, I'm using him as a wide rest saver if I were you. Uh, currently, I'm selling my Isaac Bruce if anybody's interested, if it doesn't sell by the time I get home. If you have any offers, hit me up. Xbox One, obviously. Uh, earlier today, I uh, opened up five packs with coins, so I'm going to show you guys what I pulled. So let's go newest. So uh, we're going to go backwards, obviously. So Prince Amukamara, and I'm just going to say it right now. Five packs with coins. I pulled him. Devin Hester, you can see pack opening today. Five packs with coins. I, I, I wish I would have been recording, uh, but I didn't because really when you open up five packs with coins, do you expect to get a whole heck of a lot? No. But uh, yeah, I pulled Hester, and I'm using him. I'm using him as a wide receiver and as a kick and punt returner. I'm using him. Um, that's why I'm selling Bruce because Bruce will drop. I don't know what he's going to do, and I pulled him, which makes it 24-hour card even more epic when you pull it. Uh, also pulled Rolando McClain, Team of the Week. He's about 5K. Uh, Jason Verrett. Uh, also pulled D-Ware, DeMarcus Ware, and Matt Prater. So that was a really good pack when I pulled both of them in one pack. Uh, and then uh, also pulled Jari Evans. You can see Moon and Coon, worth about 100K. So I go and I sell him, I'll be at 1.9. Also, you can get a free uh, Marshawn Lynch. Uh, I got Antonio Brown, uh, 5,000 coins if, the, if he gets 100 yards receiving. Who knows? Maybe. Uh, and then Caroline Coinup. I do not know where I got Adam Snyder from. I don't know where. Oh, I had to buy him for ground and pound because I didn't have a gold right guard for ground and pound. I had to buy Mike Evans as well, do his chem. His was expensive because he's been out of packs for a while. Um had to do the Le'Veon Bells. I already had this Ha-Ha Clinton Dix one done, so that'll make the Mandy one a little bit easier to complete with uh, having Ha-Ha Clinton Dix. Um, so it should be interesting. I should get the style of solos done this weekend for sure if I just grind, make sure I do some grinding. But I have to grind through those solos, but I do want to get it done so I can sell. This is my long pass team uh, that I'm going to be heading in there with. Uh, Warren Moon is the quarterback, so that's nice, but, uh, this is a decent team. This is the one I had to spend the most on. Ground and pound and short pass, I didn't have to spend, or no, short pass and, short pass I didn't have to spend anything on. I had all the cars with the Le'Veon Bell. I had two Le'Veon Bell short passes, so that was an easy one. Uh, the ground and pound I had to buy Mike Evans and, uh, obviously Le'Veon Bells, and for a long pass I had to buy Coon, Moon, Le'Veon Bell. Uh, so this one was a little bit more expensive, but, uh, it's no big deal. Uh, so yeah, that's going to do it for this video, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. Drop a like if you did, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll be hitting you guys with some more videos this weekend. I'm sorry for the lack of videos. Um, I've just been really busy with college, uh, trying to, uh, keep up with my accounting and my statistics class, which I'm, t I'm a technical, like, college freshman because I don't have the required credits to equate to college sophomore, but I am a college sophomore in my opinion and in pretty much all my friends' opinions. Um, and these classes, statistics and accounting, they're mostly junior seniors. Uh, there's one other sophomore in my stats class, and there's one other, there's two other sophomores in my uh, accounting class. Um, but there are four credit hour classes, so they're even harder because they're four hour credit classes. But yeah, that's going to do it for this video, guys. Hope you all enjoyed. I think I already said this, but I'm going to say it again. Drop a like on the video if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. Drop a, the like button on this video for me pulling Hester. Pulling Devin Hester. I mean, drop it a like. I was going to buy some packs with money maybe, but I don't have to do that because I pulled Hester. But I still might. Um, I don't know. I probably won't spend any money. I don't need to spend any money. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys later.